Hey everybody, this is Scott at Scott Trades on Twitter with StockMarketMentor.com and your chart of the day. Want to take a look at Texas Roadhouse. This is ticker TXRH. Now, for the most part, we've seen some pretty good relative strength in a bunch of restaurant stocks. A little while ago, I talked about Wingstop. You know, Wingstop in a nice uptrend support at that 21-day moving average. Chipotle Mexican Grill above the 21-day Domino's Pizza above the 21 day. And so we're seeing, you know, some selective restaurants actually holding up really well. So I took a look at Texas Roadhouse today, and I think this chart is actually looking better than all of them because they are all in and around the 21 day Texas Roadhouse above all the major moving averages and in a strong uptrend here. They had their recent earnings report, looks pretty positive, except for a downside, slight downside surprise on revenue, but it didn't really affect the stock that much. It popped up and then sold off, but still held above all the major moving averages. On the daily chart, I see a slight flag here, down or slipping trend line right there, and we have uh, some higher lows as well. So it is kind of in a bit of a pennant pattern, pinching a little here, and I want to see if this can break out and make a potential new high with a move above 170. So I would definitely want to set an alert on my software just around that 170.30 level and look for a strong move through that zone coming on volume. Now, one thing about this chart has me a little, you know, iffy, and that's if I flip to a weekly chart. On the weekly chart, we can see decreasing volume as the price goes up on a weekly. So it is primed for a potential weekly higher low that could see it land you know, I think down here at around 159 is probably doable. So if we do get a weekly higher low, I'd like to see that level hold as support. So there's no real rush without that break higher. And if it does end up pulling back, I'd want to see it find support right around there on a weekly level. But if we do get some upside follow through, definitely keep an eye on Texas Roadhouse and look for a move through that 170.30 pivot coming on volume. So that's just one of many things we're looking at tonight at stockmarketmentor.com. Dan Fitzpatrick added a handful of stocks to his active trade list. If you want to see that list, click the link, take a trial, and hopefully I'll see you on the other side.